All right, guys, thanks for watching. Today I'm going to show you guys how to vacuum your system out after changing the compressor, as I did right here. Okay, now that I got the vacuum pump from AutoZone, I paid $160, and when I'm done, I'm going to bring it back and get my money back. But you need to vacuum your system out after changing your compressor, as I did right here. What you want to do is connect the low side to the low side, high side to the high side, turn them down, shut them down, Open shut up the gauges all the way, turn the vacuum pump on, Make sure you connect to the top line. This one, you just leave shut. You're only going to connect one line and keep the vacuum going until it goes below zero on the low side and the high side as it is right here. I'm going to let it hold for like 45 minutes because I didn't have the compressor lines open too much to get rid of the moisture and to make sure there's no leaks in the system. All right, as you can see right now, the vacuum is way below zero on the low side and way below zero on the high side. When you shut off the valves, right here and this one and shut the pump off and it remains and it keeps holds that vacuum that means you have no leaks you're good to go you can add your freon thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more quick tips